The term spondylosis refers to degeneration of the structure of the spinal column over a long period of time from various sources. Spondylosis can result from stresses, such as sports training or repeated injuries, the development of osteoarthritis, or simply from years of poor posture. Over time, this degeneration can compress the nerve roots or spinal cord, leading to pain and dysfunction. Spondylosis pain can vary from case to case, ranging from mild to debilitating. Pressure on the nerves can lead to radiculopathy, causing pain in the neck and back, and radiating into the limbs. Severe cases can cause numbness, weakness, and loss of bladder or bowel control. After being diagnosed with spondylosis, your spinal specialist may prescribe physical therapy and medication to reduce pain and alleviate pressure. If relief is not found through conservative methods, surgery may offer some relief. Surgery will vary depending on the needs of each patient, with options ranging from decompression surgery, where the spinal surgeon carefully removes portions of the vertebral disc, or bone spurs, in order to relieve pressure on the nerves, to fusion surgery, in which the surgeon connects pieces of the spine with medical hardware to prevent movement that would cause pain and further degeneration.